hey what's up guys akshay from as learning and today in this video we'll be seeing about aspect based sentiment analysis so first of all uh, let's try to understand what exactly aspects aspect based sentiment analysis is and why do we need it in normal sentiment analysis what we do is we pass a textual input to our uh, to our model and then it tells whether it's a positive sentiment it's a negative sentiment or or it's a neutral sentiment okay now let's say it's a long passage okay and then you pass that entire passage to the model and and it will tell you it's positive negative or or it's neutral now let's say in that passage if you want to understand uh its sentiment for different kind of subcategories okay let's say it was a passage about um uh let's say it was a passage about uh, cricket okay and uh, uh, it was a passage about india's performance in world cup okay and then you want to know uh, what are the sentiments for uh, indian uh, indian bowling team indian batting team let's say any specific player let's say virat kohli or rohit sharma okay now in such cases uh, aspect based sentiment analysis comes handy it it takes into consideration the different aspects so you are in this our passage the the aspects would be uh, batting team uh, indian batting team indian bowling team let's say virat kohli uh, rohit sharma and then it will tell that for rohit sharma in that passage is the sentiment positive for virat kohli in the passage is the sentiment positive negative in this way okay so it's a recent uh, kind of a, a, a sentiment analysis modeling uh, taking it to the next level okay so here uh, we are not understanding how exactly it's work in theory i'll make a detailed video on it maybe next time here we are just seeing how to practically apply it in python and a uh, uh, short demo uh, you can see okay so here i have installed uh, the library aspect based sentiment analysis this library is uh, maintained by skelec okay so a huge shout out to them okay it's developed by skelec okay so a huge shout out to them on my collab i have installed it okay here i have uh, loaded my model i have passed a sentence that is delhi is a wonderful city to live but it has very bad pollution okay and then here i have selected my aspects as delhi and pollution so it will be telling me in this uh, document of my what is my sentiment for delhi and what is my sentiment for pollution now here we can see that the sentiment for delhi is positive okay i have uh, praised uh, uh, delhi and here the sentiment for pollution is negative okay uh, for pollution because it's a bad pollution okay so here i have printed the sentiments and here we can see that the delhi sentiment is positive and pollution's uh, sentiment is negative so in this way we have feeded uh, our two aspects delhi and pollution and we are getting our sentiments okay now if you want to see into uh, into somewhat depth like how the words are really impacting the sentiments so what you can do is from the uh, ox models module uh, you have to uh, create object of the basic pattern recognizer class okay then you have to add this recognizer into our existing uh, pipeline okay and then you have to load our model again and here we are getting a beautiful visualization of how that uh um, sentiment positive came okay now here in this first section we'll be seeing about uh, delhi okay now for delhi the score of positive was quite high it was 0.997 okay uh it was very straight forward delhi is a wonderful city so and i am expecting that the weightage should be more for wonderful so here you can see that it took into consideration uh, the words like delhi and wonderful for coming up with the weights okay then similarly we'll be seeing about uh, pollution okay in pollution we can see that uh, it is negative okay and uh, it was quite a, a very uh, uh, edge to edge uh, prediction okay and here for pollution also it has taken into consideration bad and pollution okay so in this way uh, we saw how different words are impacting our uh, sentiments okay 
now to understand what exactly importance is and what is uh, weights are okay you have to understand how exactly uh, the uh, aspect based sentiment analysis algorithm internally works okay so there are terms like professor it assigns different weights to different tokens and there's a uh, detail kind of a technique by which it comes up with the uh, prediction but we'll be discussing that in a later video okay the scope of this video was only limited to uh, applying uh, aspect based sentiment analysis using python okay so if you learn something uh, give me a thumbs up uh, for this source code you can go to my github and uh, please give me a star on github uh, it is really helpful and it motivates me a lot okay stay tuned to other like uh, check other videos also and stay tuned to AS for more such amazing tech stuff. Till then, take care. Peace out.